Hi, I'm Leon Scott Baxter, the dumbest genius you'll ever meet, author of Secrets of Safety Net Parenting, yada, yada, yada. You probably already know all about that. Uh, if, you, if you don't, though, um, what I do is I, I talk, to, talk to you about parenting. I answer parenting questions, talk about parenting. If you are new to this, uh, this channel, please subscribe below. If you want me to answer a parenting question you might have, please go ahead and comment below. And while you're at it, you might as well like this video. So I'm talking to this mom the other day. This mom tells me that her kid, her third grader, she's got a third grade girl. Her third grader has, at their school, they all have iPads. All the kids have iPads to do their schoolwork on. Wonderful. Good. I love it. I love that. The mom tells me that, that at, at home she refuses to, to do her schoolwork because she's on the iPad using the apps, playing games, right? So mom, she asks me, she said, hey, is there a way that I can control her iPad? I, she says, I want to find an app I can put on my, my smartphone so I can go ahead and turn her iPad on and off. So she says, Leon, is there, is there, an, is there an, uh, an app for that? Is there an app for that? And I, I said, uh, you, sh you should probably look into that. I, there might be. I don't know. If you, if you can't find a, an app for that, I, I've got another idea. She says, what, what is it? What's the, what's the other idea? What can I do to control it so my kid doesn't use her iPad when I don't want her to? And I said, oh, you could, you could just uh, take it and, and put it on a high shelf. Because, because that's what parents used to do back in the day, and, and, it, and it still works today. And mom says, but... But she screams. If I take her iPad away, she screams. I said, and? Is screaming going to kill her? No, 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 no. But if I take the iPad away and she screams, the neighbors might think we're beating her. I said, uh, are you beating her? Uh, no, we're, we're, not, we're not beating her. Then take the iPad away and don't worry about what the neighbors think. She said, but, but, uh, but what? I could see her screaming so much that, that the police might come. Okay, so, so let them come. You didn't call them. And when they ask what the problem is, you say, I took my kid's iPad away and put it up on a shelf so she could do her homework. Oh, I bet those police will have a couple words to say to your child. And they probably will include, do not make us come back out here and waste our valuable time for something this ridiculous. Kids need rules, they need boundaries, and when they push them, we can't let uh, the fear of what our neighbors might think dictate our good parenting. We know better than that. Do what's right and things may get uncomfortable, but just for a little bit because your child realizes that you're going to follow through and that the boundaries are set. Life becomes easier when you stick with your guns. When you stick with your guns. And if the cops do come, she's not going to pull that again. If you want to chime in about this, leave a comment below and you might as well like the video and subscribe to the channel if you haven't done that already. Also, check out my website, safetynetters.com and if you want more like this, at your disposal, consider grabbing my book. It's called Secrets of Safety Net Parenting. You can grab that on Amazon.com. Take care. Thanks for coming. Drive carefully.